flood warning remains in effect until further notice. What minor flooding is forecast? Where Calgashu River near White Oak Park? When until further notice? Impacts at 2.0 feet. Minor flooding of Goose Ferry Road will occur. Additional details at 7:35 p.m. Central Daylight Time Friday. The stage was 1.9 feet. Forecast. The river is expected to rise above flood stage late this evening and continue rising to a crest of 2.2 feet early tomorrow afternoon. Flood stage is 2.0 feet. HTTP colon slash slash www.weather.gov slash safety slash flood. Flood warning remains in effect until further notice. What? Minor flooding is occurring and minor flooding is forecast. Where? Nages River and Nages River Salt Water Barrier. When? Until further notice. Impacts at 6.0 feet. Collier's Ferry Park is underwater and flooding of secondary roads near the river can be expected. Additional details at 8.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time Friday the stage was 5.2 feet. Recent activity. The maximum river stage in the 24 hours ending at 8.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time Friday was 5.2 feet. Forecast. The river is expected to rise to a crest of 5.9 feet early Sunday afternoon. Flood stage is 4.0 feet. HTTP colon slash slash www.weather.gov slash safety slash flood. Flood warning remains in effect until further notice. What? Minor flooding is occurring and minor flooding is forecast. Where? Subby River near Dewey When? Until further notice. Impacts at 25.0 feet. Lowest roads beside the river flood around Dewey and subject to being closed. In addition, low-lying roads in southwest Beauregard Parish are flooded including Robert Clark Road. Flooding occurs on the south side of Niblick Bluff Park with access roads to camp houses cut off around the park. Access roads to the river in northeastern Orange County become flooded. Additional details at 7.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time Friday the stage was 24.8 feet. Recent activity, the maximum river stage in the 24 hours ending at 7.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time Friday was 24.8 feet. Forecast, the river is expected to rise to a crest of 25.2 feet early Monday afternoon. Flood stage is 24.0 feet. HTTP colon slash slash www.weather.gov slash safety slash flood. Flood warning in effect until Monday afternoon. What? Minor flooding is forecast. Where? Nages River near Town Bluff. When? Until Monday afternoon. Impacts at 65.0 feet. Areas around Barlow Lake and Brushy Lake begin to flood. Additional details. At 8 p.m. Central Daylight Time Friday, the stage was 67.8 feet. Forecast. The river is expected to rise above flood stage late this evening to a crest of 68.5 feet just after midnight tonight. It will then fall below flood stage early Monday morning. Flood stage is 68.0 feet. HTTP colon slash slash www.weather.gov slash safety slash flood. And now for your seven-day forecast. Rest of tonight, mostly cloudy. Showers likely with a chance of thunderstorms. Near steady temperature in the mid-70s. East winds around five miles per hour. Chance of rain 60%. Saturday, showers with a chance of thunderstorms in the morning, then showers and thunderstorms likely in the afternoon. Human with highs in the mid-80s. Northeast winds around 5 miles per hour, becoming south in the afternoon. Chance of rain 80%. Saturday night, partly cloudy in the evening, then mostly cloudy with a chance of showers and thunderstorms after midnight. Human with lows in the mid-70s. Southeast winds around 5 miles per hour. Chance of rain 40%. Sunday, 
and showers likely with a chance of thunderstorms in the morning, then showers with thunderstorms likely in the afternoon. Humid with highs in the upper 80s. South winds 5 to 10 miles per hour. Chance of rain 80%. Sunday night, mostly cloudy. Humid with lows in the upper 70s. South winds around 5 miles per hour. Monday, mostly sunny. A chance of showers and thunderstorms in the afternoon. Highs around 90. Chance of rain 30%. Monday night, mostly clear. Lows in the upper 70s. Tuesday, sunny. A chance of showers and thunderstorms in the afternoon. Highs in the lower 90s. Chance of rain 30%. Tuesday night through Thursday night, mostly clear. Lows in the upper 70s. Highs in the lower 90s. Friday, sunny. A chance of showers and thunderstorms in the afternoon. Highs in the lower 90s. Chance of rain 40%. Now for the official National Weather Service forecast for the southwest Louisiana coastal waters, including Calcasieu Lake. Tonight, southeast winds around 10 knots. Seas 2 feet. Lake waters a light chop. Slight chance of thunderstorms until midnight, then chance of thunderstorms after midnight. Saturday, south winds around 10 knots. Seas 2 feet. Lake waters a light chop. Showers with thunderstorms likely in the morning, then chance of thunderstorms in the afternoon. Saturday night, south winds around 10 knots. Seas 2 feet. Lake waters a light chop. Slight chance of thunderstorms until midnight, then chance of thunderstorms after midnight. Sunday, south winds around 10 knots. Seas 2 feet. Lake waters a light chop. Showers likely in the morning. Chance of thunderstorms through the day. Sunday night, south winds around 50 knots. Seas 2 to 3 feet. Lake waters a light chop. Chance of thunderstorms after midnight. Monday, south winds around 10 knots. Seas 2 to 3 feet. Lake waters a light chop. Tuesday, south winds around 10 knots. Seas 2 to 3 feet. Lake waters a light chop. Wednesday, south winds around 10 knots. Seas 2 to 3 feet. Lake water smooth. This is the NOAA Weather Radio KHP 42 in Lake Charles, the voice of the National Weather Service. These are the 8 p.m. observations. In Lake Charles, it was cloudy. The temperature was 78 and the relative humidity 87%. The wind was east at 3 miles an hour. The pressure was 29.96 inches and steady. In Beaumont, it was cloudy. The temperature was 78. The wind was southeast at 3 miles an hour. In Lafayette, it was cloudy. The temperature was 79. The wind was northeast at 3 miles an hour. At Leesville and Fort Polk, it was cloudy. The temperature was 80. At Alexandria, it was mostly cloudy. The temperature was 79. The wind was east at 9 miles an hour. Throughout northern Louisiana and eastern Texas, temperatures were between 77 and 78 degrees. At Shreveport, rain was falling. In Monroe, it was mostly cloudy. It was cloudy at Lufkin and Jasper. Here are some marine observations. At Calcasieu Pass, winds were calm. At Bowie 30 South High Island, winds were east at 8 knots. Sea temperature 84 degrees. Air temperature 80 degrees. Again, at 8 p.m. in Lake Charles, it was cloudy. The temperature was 78. Flood watch remains in effect through Saturday afternoon. What? Flooding caused by excessive rainfall continues to be possible. Where? Portions of southwest Louisiana, including the following parishes, East Cameron and West Cameron and Southeast Texas, including the following areas, Lower Jefferson, Southern Orange and Upper Jefferson. 
wet through Saturday afternoon. Impacts. Excessive runoff may result in flooding of rivers, creeks, streams, and other low-lying and flood-prone locations. Creeks and streams may rise out of their banks. Flooding may occur in poor drainage and urban areas. Low water crossings may be flooded. Additional details, http colon slash slash www.weather.gov slash safety slash flood. You should monitor later forecasts and be alert for possible flood warnings. Those living in areas prone to flooding should be prepared to take action should flooding develop. Flood warning now in effect until further notice. What? Minor flooding is occurring and minor flooding is forecast. Where? Pages River near Evadale. When? Until further notice. Impacts at 17.0 feet. Minor flooding expected with the boat ramps at Evadale possibly becoming inaccessible. Flooding can be expected in the low-lying areas of the Lakeview community in Orange County. Additional details. At 8 p.m. Central Daylight Time Friday, the stage was 17.2 feet. Recent activity. The maximum river stage in the 24 hours ending at 8 p.m. Central Daylight Time Friday was 17.2 feet. Forecast. The river will rise to 17.3 feet early tomorrow afternoon. It will then fall below flood stage early Sunday morning to 16.8 feet early Monday morning. It will rise above flood stage early Monday afternoon to 17.1 feet early Wednesday afternoon. It will then fall again but remain above flood stage. Flood stage is 17.0 feet. HTTP colon slash slash www.weather.gov slash safety slash flood. Flood warning remains in effect until further notice. What? Minor flooding is forecast. Where? Calgashu River near White Oak Park. When? Until further notice. Impacts. At 2.0 feet, minor flooding of Goose Ferry Road will occur. Additional details. At 7.35 p.m. Central Daylight Time Friday, the stage was 1.9 feet. Forecast. The river is expected to rise above flood stage late this evening and continue rising to a crest of 2.2 feet early tomorrow afternoon. Flood stage is 2.0 feet. HTTP colon slash slash www.weather.gov slash safety slash flood. Flood warning remains in effect so until further notice. What? Minor flooding is occurring and minor flooding is forecast. Where? Nages River at Nages River Salt Water Barrier. When? Until further notice. Impacts at 6.0 feet. Collier's Ferry Park is underwater, and flooding of secondary roads near the river can be expected. Additional details at 8.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time Friday, the stage was 5.2 feet. Recent activity, the maximum river stage in the 24 hours ending at 8.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time Friday was 5.2 feet. Forecast, the river is expected to rise to a crest of 5.9 feet early Sunday afternoon. Flood stage is 4.0 feet. HTTP colon slash slash www.weather.gov slash safety slash flood. Flood warning remains in effect until further notice. What? Minor flooding is occurring and minor flooding is forecast. Where? Subbing River near Dweeyville. When? Until further notice. Impacts at 25.0 feet, lowest roads beside the river flood around Dweeyville and subject to being closed. In addition, low-lying roads in southwest Beauregard Parish are flooded including Robert Clark Road. Flooding occurs on the south side of Niblick Bluff Park with access roads to camp houses cut off around the park. Access roads to the river in northeastern Orange County become flooded. Additional details, at 7.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time Friday, the stage was 24.8 feet. Recent activity, the maximum river stage in the 24 hours ending at 7.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time Friday was 24.8 feet. Forecast, the river is expected to rise to a crest at 25.2 feet early Monday afternoon. 
flood stage is 24.0 feet. HTTP colon slash slash www.weather.gov slash safety slash flood. Flood warning in effect until Monday afternoon. What minor flooding is forecast? Where? Nations River near Town Bluff. When? Until Monday afternoon. Impacts at 65.0 feet. Areas around Barlow Lake and Brushy Lake begin to flood. Additional details. At 8 p.m. Central Daylight Time Friday, the stage was 67.8 feet. Forecast. The river is expected to rise above flood stage late this evening to a crest of 68.5 feet just after midnight tonight. It will then fall below flood stage early Monday morning. Flood stage is 68.0 feet. HTTP colon slash slash www.weather.gov slash safety slash flood. And now for your seven day forecast.